All right, everybody, we are back again with another quick voice meter tutorial. This was brought to my attention by somebody in the comments, and they wanted to know, because they're a singer, they wanted to know how to put reverb in voice meter potato. Okay, so what we're going to do is we see I have my voice meter pulled up, and right here we see my microphone. Okay, now we, we already went through what my microphone is hooked to. My microphone goes to B2, which right over here is, I have labeled mic, voice meter, auxiliary. This is B2. Okay, now, re putting reverb on your microphone is very, very easy. If we go right over here to where this audio cassette tape is, near the hardware out, we see special effects. For the special effects, right over here, we have reverb, okay? So what you're gonna do is you're gonna go over to where your microphone is, and you see right here, special effects. Right here, we have reverb. So we're gonna click on that, and we're just gonna that all the way up to 10, but we're not done. We have to go all the way over here to the master section. And we see here on B2, we see the meter going up. You see the little R right here on uh, next to the first dial. We're gonna click that and we're gonna push that all the way up to 10. Now, after we do that, we can go to the reverb and you just, Click, and now there should be reverb on my voice. Okay, there should be reverb. Now, what you're gonna do is you're gonna right click. You can bring this over, and now you can control. We have vocal, church, stadium, club, soft, Pipe, special, medium, large. And we also have these volume controls down here. You have your hertz, uh, you have your dry, wet, delay, uh, decay. So you can play around with these things. Uh, this right here, you know, I don't know what that really does. I'm not really big into reverb. But this is how you use reverb. You go to church, medium, large, short, and then we have dry, turn it up and turn it down. You know, I, I don't know what these things do. So you have room, short, medium. You have plate, short, medium, large, tall, short, medium, large, plate, and we go back to vocal. Okay, this is a preset. So you go medium, short, whatever it is, church, you like that. So again, this is how you turn the reverb on. And you just click it like that to shut it off and you see that there's no more reverb on my voice. But this was just a quick video on how to show you how to use reverb in voice meter. And also please like, comment, and subscribe. There's gonna be a huge, uh, uh, a huge rolling out of a lot of technical videos. Um, I'm gonna do a few more on voice meter with streaming. I'm gonna do a, uh, quite a few with a new streaming software that a lot of people have been raving about. I haven't used it yet, but I've set up stuff and I haven't used it to stream yet. It's called Prism Live Studio. So get ready for that to come out. And also a bunch of other tech videos, microphones. I'm also gonna be coming out with a how to start streaming video. And in that, I'm going to link a bunch of products that you can get for, for cheap, how I started out. Even some of my products now, I'm gonna link so you guys, if you wanna upgrade, if you wanna do whatever, I'll have a full list of all the equipment that you essentially that you need to stream 
do a podcast, or make YouTube videos. So until the next time, peace, I'm out.